Greetings YouTubians and welcome back to Koza Channel. If you just watched the last episode, you know that something just, like, uh, made noises. Um, this is Penumbra Overture. We are, as far as I understand, getting close to the end. These are definitely getting a lot creepier. Um, contemporary money. Yeah, that looks definitively like a cage. Oh, good God. Section C, what? Oh, wolves. Hello, wolves. Shaft 12. Okay. How far down does he go? I hope he goes far enough. Oh, I'm screwed. Alright. I haven't explored much of this yet, so I don't exactly know what I'm doing. That is a lot of different, like, areas. I don't know. Okay, there's another wolf. There's at least two of them down here. Probably a third. Okay, so tool storage, refinery, let's go to the tool storage in section C first. Is that a wolf? Sure sounds like, well, oh my god, there is one. Alright, got away. My luck, both of these doors are going to be blocked. But tool storage, that, that is a big number. Oh, what? It's sealed off at one stage. I guess it's open now. All right. Do 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 do. Oh great. Doesn't look like anything's in here. All right, let's close the door for safety's sake. Which is probably just gonna lock me. Communication kits. Lock me in here with whatever in here it. What the. That is a surprisingly nice, like, <laughs> okay then. What the? What in the world? What are they doing down here? Section C, iron mine shaft. Okay, we'll go to that door in a second. Let's see what's over here. This should be tools, so there shouldn't be Anything too spectacular in here. All right. Wire cutters, or bolt cutters, sorry. Screwdriver, which is a safe. Those break, okay. Did not realize those broke. Right, and that's too heavy, of course. Hey, seriously? Seriously? Work with me here. I need help. Even though I'm fully healed, so there's no reason for it, but whatever. Always keep health kits. This door is not just designed to just fall open. Oh gosh. Oh great. Another security pad. Extra precaution at this section. Yeah, that is a good question. Uh, I don't know. We'll find out later. Okay, so section C is locked as I expected. Uh, okay, so let's get back to the map. Okay, so we can go north to shaft 12 in the refinery or shaft 13. Let's go to 12. So he's gonna turn down that hallway. Wait, what? What hallway is that? Wait, where's he going? What is he doing? Oh, he's like. Okay, he's just like going down that way. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, I know where that is. All right, and then what's, what's the point of that? Whatever, not really that important. All right, should be in the clear now. Not like them. What? See why they'd need fencing down here? Yeah, what were? Yeah, like well, and it's weird because like it keeps. It's not really like keeping anything out anyway. Another security door? Is this one locked from the other side? Awesome. Okay, so Chef 12 is out. All right, they've got to let me in one of these dang locks. Oh, okay. Whoop, let's pull back. Where, where'd he go? Oh gosh, there he is. 
Alright, get going, get going. Section C, shaft 12, shaft 13, and the refinery. I guess maybe we're supposed to go to the refinery for... Okay, hang on. Before we do that, I want to know what is with this little hallway here. Because this is weird. Oh, hey, what's this? It'll never open again. Poppy! Yep, that's not working. I need to start thinking straight. Nice, thanks! What you trying to say? Whoop. Right, let's back up. Yeah, he's coming this way. turn the corner and then he's gonna go down that little hallway and then we can sneak past him it's amazing that he can't see me oh good god can he see me okay he can't all right let's go 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 fortunately the wolves it's so strange that wolves zombie wolves would just be down here like patrolling do they <laughs> They getting paid good for it at least. I <laughs> not really entirely understanding that one, but whatever. No time to question. That is okay. Great. Aren't just they do quite some damage. Maybe I could use them. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. Whoa. Which direction is he going? Whoa. Whoa. Oh god. Uh-oh. 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 Back off. Back off. Back off. Back off. Go the other way. Go the other way. Don't, don't notice me. Oh, good God. I do not. <laughs> Normally when you see him up close like that, it's like, oh, they're less scary now, but nope. That was actually freakier. Oh, God. Go over that way, puppy. Go over that way. I don't want none of what you selling. Please be openable. All right, Good. at least I can get in one door. Jeez. Oh, hello. All right, whole bunch of stuff here. Cool. Can I go in? Oh, darn. Uh. Wow, that's a very interesting way to put it. It also crossed the rocks. Why do you have to? Control panel for the pistons. I'm like clicking things. Hey! <gasps> Did that work? Ow! Hey, this seems like a terrible idea. Do not like! Do not like! Yep, don't like that! Ah, only the engraving etched in the back of my mind can compare to the sight you must be seeing. Now power has returned. I wish I could be there with you, but circumstances do not allow for Is it gonna crush it? Oh, it'd be cool Maybe if it crushed it. something you can do about that. But tell me, are there ever built conveyors without churning in the rock room? I yes. I know they mean. It is some kind of heaven. What is this? What is that? Spare motor? Hmm, that actually seems important. Yeah, what is up with this thing? I believe it was standard corrosion. Yeah. I, I have a hard time believing that's just corrosion. I mean, I guess this is pretty old, but still. Oh, it's closed off. Okay, so the spare motors... Yeah, it's clearly important for something. in the... 
Alright, let's take one of these as well. And rocks, because we have to put the rocks. Okay, one rock, and the other rock. I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna put that in there. Tip! Is that, oh, seriously, come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. <laughs> I have no idea what I just did. Does it just like get stuck or like go off into oblivion or did I actually like do something? What was that? Can I like lean and look in there? Come on, let me look in there. I wanna know what I did. What? What was that? Did I actually Oh what? Oh, they come out! Oh, that's hilarious. Okay. Oh, that's funny. I didn't expect them to actually, like, come out anywhere. I guess that makes sense, though. Whoa. Hey, what's that? Can I break that? Ow. What? Oh, come on. Work with me here. Fall, darn you! Get in there! Oh, fine. I don't think it's gonna explode anyway, so whatever. Okay, let's put the rocks on this thing. Are you gonna crush it? Yes. Take the rocks! Take them! Alright, so we go... I don't know what... Come on. Why?! Damn, it's like, hmm, maybe the rocks. Ow. Oh, shoot. I hope I wasn't supposed to like, put the rocks in there. This seems like a valid strategy too though. Awesome. Did I need that spare motor? Because I feel like I probably did. I'm actually surprised that worked. <gasps> there they are, the rocks! We are now such good and lasting friends. Ow. I have gifted you with my love. Perhaps you could give me After all, the flaws of politeness would be shattered if you were to appear at my party without a gift. Here at your party. So hungry. He could eat both the horse and the young rippling stable hand. Jesus. Certainly, pony flesh is so hard to come by in this part. Man meat is so I can so bland. If what? Eyes, hmm. I upon a scurrying rodent. Oh. You, That's because it's broken. Happened upon a scurrying rodent. <laughs> no! No, I say! Get off there, let's go down this way, let's grab the motor. Uh, yeah, we can... Actually, we can just take the motor back in. Oh, it slows me down too much. Didn't expect that. Alright, let's put the motor there, it's gonna go back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go! Walk! Faster! Run! Come on, I can move faster than that. Is it gonna fall? Please fall. It's probably not gonna fall. Oh, come on. Hurry up! Alright, there it goes. Oh my gosh. Good thing I didn't break. Alright, so now it's gonna go over there, and then we 
you take this up. Here. I wonder if this is actually how they move, like, certain things around, like, factories and mining things. Hey, yeah, we got the conveyor belt anyway, and it needs to go there, so might as well use the conveyor belt. It's already used to lifting, you know, ten tons of rock, so why not have to get it lift, you know, 50 pounds of machinery. Alright, let's put the motor in. Yeah, okay. Haha! Rocks, come with me! We're going on an adventure! They are my special. They're my crew. My posse. Oh. The hell? Yeah, that doesn't look safe. Oh, it moves. What? Ow. <laughs> Great. Okay, so I can make it like two. Ow. Nope. I can make it like one. <laughs> okay, so. So one. And then there. And then right next to it. Okay. Ha! Suck it! Oh, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? What? Oh, got it. Darn barrels! Confusing me. Yeah. Smarter than the average rodent! Very rusty pipes. Or air shafts. Air ducts? Ducks. Yeah, ducks. That's what they are. <laughs> I know my construction anatomy. Shut up. <laughs> okay, maybe this isn't the end of the game. I thought that this was the end of the game. Or like I was getting close to it, but clearly. Alright, seriously? <laughs> Move that thing! Wait, where is this? Or is this shaft C? The <laughs> section C. No, this is... Oh. Oh, this is shaft 12. Got it. Completely hosed up. <laughs> yeah, this looks like fun. What? Go. Oh. Oh. Cut! Aha! Success! No, come back here! Aw, I wanted in. Ha ha ha! Amazing. It's a save point, so nothing in here can kill me, right? <laughs> Suddenly they introduce a monster. Cohort, a man with no name. It is he who opens the, this gateway to hell. A grin on his face, he is terrible indeed. He watches the men writhe and turn. So far there is something vital in his hand. What? getting crowded in there like I'm just one visitor of many they all seem familiar yeah one of them is my father research but we've come a long way since these common okay I hear noises and I'm ignoring them because I'm assuming nothing can kill me please oh please nothing be able to kill me Pretty well battered, very still, still very reliable. Okay, so that's. Oh, and I can pick up the worm. Goodbye, worm. Small issues to do with juvenile. Can't be much older than the wall I demolished. Hey, that looks important. What? Why can't I take that? I'm going to a large species of alien an an analid analid. Haha! -ha! Ooh. Badly faded, but it looks like close to view of some. Is it Annalyn a worm? Images and notes relating to the gray rockworm. This thing is big for an invertebrate. 
Haha, light. I have a pencil. Back off. Really? With the health kits? Uh, wildlife. Okay. But I think the key's still in the lock. So, what? I need a way to collect it from the door. Oh, right. Haha! I am so smart! Uh, connecting the rooms pitch black. Grabs a darn paper! There, finally. Alright. Metal key. Door. What's over there? Ooh. Two. I don't like the... There's only uh, one green-blooded land dwelling creature big enough to lose force. this much blood. There are places you should not go for, for fear of death. Lizards. The lives here, just like you and I, and just like you and I, he must ingest the living flesh of those less fortunate than him. Oh, great. There is a small place that I do not want you to visit, even on your holidays, because it is dark and evil place that I've been. When the darkness what the hell? Overwhelmed by small decaying mind. What in the world? Some bad things have flowed from my Such mind. Such was just an inevitable. Pen, the brilliant blue ink itself. <gasps> Holy crap! And by the way, should you turn peckish, red is at its finest sautéed with a little engine oil. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting. Must be an ultra vet. Definitely a product for deranged mind, but who's? Flesh, flesh, no light. Cold blood. Alright. Oh, great. Am I, like... Slime everywhere. Am I supposed... To, I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing... What am I supposed to be doing here? Okay, that's... A freaking creepy room. Don't know if there's any point, but it's creepy. <sighs> okay. Alright. That, that thing happened. Alright, so it doesn't look like I can actually do anything more in here. Someone must have a great deal of pain. Oh, yeah, okay. Doesn't look like I can get through there. I don't think I can get through here either. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm getting. Oh, wait, maybe I have to use this. And it doesn't look like that's doing anything. Alright, so. What do I. Do I kill the sl Okay. Slugs die! I can at least kill something. Dead slugs! That's right, no more slugs for you. Uh, so what What do I do now? Is there anything to do? Violence. What is this? It's like babies? Go back to your mothers! Oh, hey, there's a thing. Uh, study, aim to investigate, can, caddis. So, wait, what is this? Oh, no, 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 go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Rockworm set, here we go. Upon arrival, I was immediately stunned by the sheer volume of fauna that finds a way of life down here, despite the conditions in general, one would assume that species. Natural habitat has passed a certain depth to find the intrusion of human activity too great a threat to remain in place, however, almost the exact opposite. It's curious that certain areas of the mine appear to be entirely without life of any kind, yet deeper. Let's see if we commit further time. So there's life in parts of the mine and not in other parts. Pages to scroll down, whatever comes to my. What is this stuff anyway? Some kind of research paper? No matter. Paper all the same. Oh, hey, interesting. You can finally record what's been happening down here. 
for about a year. It's been near the end of 2001 by now. Christmas was no matter. Too tired to write now. Oh, interesting. So there's like, oh my gosh, there's a bunch. Okay. All right. All right, we'll read this and then we'll end the episode because we are out of time. The mission process has been far easier than any. The setup of the artificial environment for the rock room without any specimens themselves. Healthy size, perhaps even beyond record size. And I can see the zoos three adults, two larva infant dead. Me. Who's me? Is that me? I hope that's not me. Was meaning to record events today, but too busy securing the area. I've used some supplies from the old money to wall myself. So it's a pretty lucky stumbling here. All this research about something similar to what's been hunting me ever since I escaped the shelter four days ago. Don't get me wrong, after what? What they did to me back there, I'd rather be facing anything else than after. Almost a year of fighting for our lives, we didn't really stand a chance. Good to know so I have some way to fight these things. Rockworms have followed me here. I don't know how they knew I was coming or how they managed to follow me in the dark. Maybe I can work that out now. I found some old newspaper clippings referring to that. I had no idea it was so old, so big. A lot of history. Resting your hopes and rescue of sign. One of the scientists who escaped. Jeez, so we figured we would blah 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 blah. Answers it as if it first what's been released. Observations. Oh my gosh, there's like so much information here. Well, there's actually not that much information. He's saying, I tried to escape. It was pretty horrible. This is less horrible. And now hopefully I can find a way to stop them. He doesn't. He doesn't. He dies. I'm almost certain. Creatures are indeed larger than the juveniles seem to be growing far beyond. Although the adults have now expired, I will watch with interest to see the lifespan of the particular subspecies. The worms appear to have three senses, as we do by previous or taste, smell, and an extreme sensitive touch, which allows them to vibrations rock the same way that human senses beams of light and process them in spatial images their natural prey is insects smaller than themselves heaven help those insects because the worm is a vicious and efficient killer oh their natural prey i was thinking predator it was vicious and efficient he's wrong they have no sense of smell today with a concoction i found lying around but to no avail However, it does seem that they attack movement via vibrations, which would explain how they can see in the dark. There's no way to escape them down here. We're on their territory now. Lifespan is three days and counting. I can still hear them outside the wall. I've locked myself in the smaller study area. Connected to them. If they get through the wall, I doubt the door will stop them, but it's better than nothing. Genus. So they can't smell. Okay. Bird's environment. Released above seems likely that it would quickly destroy the existing rockworm population, and soon after that, the population would grow to a size far outstripping its own food supplies. Since size only hypothesize the worm unless for a reasonable three to four thousand years could grow up to a further grow up to a further three inches, making it a total of almost a one foot long. However, should those conditions change or indeed magnify, it could occur far more rapidly. They've begun to surround my location. I can't tell whether or not they've breached the wall. So he thinks they only grow to a foot. That was much bigger than a foot. I certainly have entered whatever area surrounds this room. The future looks increasingly bleak. I could now realize I could write all I wanted. No one will ever make it down here to read it. So why write this now? Good question. I have no answer. All I do know is I'd rather take my own life than die at the jaws of the... I've tied a noose. Those monsters may feed on my corpse, but they won't take my life. That's really gross. Where's the noose? That's odd. He said he tied a noose, but I don't see one. Alright, well, this has been thoroughly creepy. Can I leave now? Is there anything else down here? I don't think there's anything else down here. Alright, I'm leaving. Forget that noise! Very interesting, like, story aspect. Uh, though. I don't know if it actually, like... Wait, oh, right. Uh, I don't know if that actually, like, affected anything. I mean, it, it progressed the game, I guess. Alright. That is a save point! So, we're gonna end the episode there. Um, this game's going on much longer than I expected it! What? Oh, good god. What? What? <gasps> ah! Alright, anyway. Um, thank you for tuning in. This has been... Koza's channel, I'm your host, Koza, another episode of Penumbra Overture, and there will be more to come from the looks of it, so thank you for tuning in, and definitely tune into the next one. You dead? He's not dead! Oh my gosh, he's not dead. Okay, cannot kill them with rocks, good to know. 
Batteries! Yes! Give me all the batteries! Pills... Flares... I... Oh, the music, like, is really confusing. It keeps sounding like it's stopping, but then it doesn't, like, really stop. So I don't really know what's going on. 